All this month, KITV4 is going into neighborhoods to find out where you live. That's right. This morning, we're heading to Kaimuki, one of the city's first suburbs and one of the oldest communities. KITV4's Ryan Kalesuji joins us live this morning from Wailai Avenue with more on the history of this neighborhood. Good morning, Ryan. Hey, good morning, Jill uh, and uh, Laura. We've traveled inside to Coffee Talk, or if for you Saturday Night Live fans, you pronounce it as Coffee Talk, no big whoop, uh, which is one of the many businesses here along Wailai Avenue. And now, uh, take a look at this picture here that's actually inside Coffee Talk. This is actually uh, some old photographs of what this area used to look like. You can see here there's the Paradise Food Market as well as the Kaimuki Bakery. And one of the unique qualities about Kaimuki is their ability to incorporate some of the old traditions and the old culture into a modern lifestyle. But there are a lot of businesses, a lot of things going on here in the area that was once considered uh, the downtown district of Honolulu. Now, but long before people or homes started piling into Kaimuki, King Kamehameha used this shield volcano as a lookout to spot enemies arriving in Waikiki. It's where he stationed his troops in preparation for the Battle of Oahu, now one of the many uses of Kaimuki Hill throughout the year. There was a crater, and um, some of the Mo'olelo tell us that there was a big emu that, that was made there. Um, and so Kaimu Ki, Ki is another word for um, tea leaf or lai, where tea leaf would have been cooked um, and, and utilized in this particular emu. Now, Pu'u'o Kaimu Ki, which is now a park, was used as an observatory, telegraph, and reservoir which supplied water to the dry and dusty and developing suburb of Honolulu at around the start of the 20th century. Now, many people talk about the district of Kaimuki. It actually, to residents say, it extends from Kahalama going uh, ever towards Kapuhulu and from Kilauea Avenue up to where we are here on Wailai. Definitely a lot of history still in this neighborhood. Reporting live from Coffee Talk in Kaimuki, I'm Ryan Kalei Suji. Back to you guys. He's been wanting to say that all morning. He's so, isn't he Jewish? <laughs> I think he's Jewish. Can't you tell? So much history. I love Kaimuki. <laughs>